Welcome to the show. We're going to watch some baggage. That's what I've been hitting. This is Jonathan. He's got a secret, and it's hidden inside this red bag. Okay. Did he sleep with his boss to get a promotion? Oh, oh wanted he to. earned zero dollars for the past three years. Yeah, he's invested. Or did he appear in seven adult films? Uh, we'll open up this bag and a whole, whole lot, lot more, more coming up on Baggage. Uh, this episode of Baggage is brought to you by shop.johnboymedia.com. Swag. Got a whole new line of these champion sweaters, which is my favorite sweater company, but it says with John Boy on it. I actually really like these understated JM line. Thanks. Hi, Thanks I'm Jerry Springer. Shop. Welcome to Baggage, where singles confess their dirty secrets in the search for new love. Right now, let's meet our dater. He's a bar manager from New Rochelle, New York. Please welcome Jonathan. Idiots on North Ave. Let's go. Hey, go this guy Gales. Is definitely from yeah. New Rochelle. Yeah, go. go Gales, baby. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. He looks like he works in the building. I mean, you're bartender we in New Rochelle. About. You're you're North Ave. Mm. You have got mm. college kids. My dad was a bartender on North yeah. Ave in New Rochelle. Might be your dad. Yes. <laughs> so what was his baggages? Definitely doesn't do porn. No money, porn, and bang the boss. Could be boss, but he's a bar manager. Yes. Nice to have you so with it's us the here. middle. Uh, I gotta find out if we love him or hate for? Uh, Jerry, being a typical New York loud, big family Italian type of guy, yeah. I'm, I'm looking for someone I can bring Proud home laughed. to mom because mom could be picky. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Well, Why here's the laugh? good news. Uh, he didn't say anything. I've seen funny. the three women. People yeah, love it Italians. Looks like they may be women you can bring home to mom. Okay. But like all of us, they've got some baggage. Mm-hmm. Are you ready to meet him? Yes, I am. All right, let's bring him on now. She's an so English far, professor he, he from Oklahoma. He hasn't made me lean one way or the other. So He's far. good looking now, but boy, is he going to be ugly in 20 years. Uh, that's called being Italian. Go to one New York Rangers game. Maybe the ugliest place in New York City. See you there. Go, go, Gers. What do they say? Go, Gers. The city, say hello to La Chelle. Oh, he's not into that. I like cooking ethnic cuisines going to erotic <laughs> places, and if you pick me, I'll be your lover <laughs> and your best friend. Whoa, good start. Why are you laughing yeah, so much? Oh, are Zach's faces were good. <laughs> Every time she said ethnic, he was pretty taken aback. She's from Oklahoma. Yeah. That just means New York. He's ethnic. And character. then she basically, her cell was like, I'll cook you food and sex with you. So I think she diagnosed the Italian in the room. He's not into that. He knows he can't bring her home. Why'd you say knows? Yeah, not bad. Yeah. Okay, let's see if mom likes the next one. Not bad, not bad. She's a makeup artist Great from call. Benicia, California. Give it up for Soraya. I'm an adventurous, self-sufficient woman, and I've walked across fire, and if you pick me, I'll walk through flames for you. Ooh, nice. you Sounds good. good. Oh, I, I, you like that? That's good news. Unless her either. house burned down, she walked <laughs> over the coals. <laughs> Right now, he's like, my mom's not going to like either of these. No, I think he's... I think and she's in And finally, play. she is a writer from Indianapolis. Let's hear it from Melissa. Hi, John. He's happy. My name is Melissa, and I can't believe these two girls didn't mention how beautiful you are. Oh, thank you. <laughs> but Make me blush. I, oh, uh -huh. I'm a romantic poet, and who knows, maybe you'll be the happy ending to my new book. Definitely, he thinks his mom's going to like her the best because she's the most... Uh, no, the middle reminds me. He's bought a small, medium, and large bag, each hiding a personal secret known as their that baggage. That dress is... We haven't it seen something like that on baggage. Your middle girl is wearing a baggage shirt. Let's start like, that is a baggage out what middle girls wear. <laughs> We've had this already. <laughs> Not from a lady, though. In the shower That's a common male trope. Equal, equal. Water. Doesn't everyone? Uh, yeah, I, no. Well, uh, <laughs> it's environmentally friendly. You're saving water. I mean, it's a win-win, and it just, all the dirtiness just kind of washes away. Uh, I'll do a little parentheses you know. talk real quick. <laughs> I pee in the do, shower. Hold on. Okay, I'll do a little parentheses talk right now. Okay, are you ready? We've interviewed someone on baggage, and we've talked to the contestants. And what they've told us, and we're in the secret safe zone of parentheses, is that they talk with the people for an hour, and then they have no idea what's about to pop up. And then it's just something a conversation they had with the producers, and they choose three things, and they turn it into baggage. So that's a lot of times why they defend it. 
she is the most like we've seen someone just literally do that. She's like, what did they write? Doesn't everyone? This is very genuine of her to be like, wait, what? That's what you guys chose for me? Hmm. To conserve water. Literally. Doesn't everyone? Like that's very genuine reaction to how we've been told baggage works. The producers. So you think she's surprised that it's considered baggage? Yes. Like I think she's right there. She's genuinely surprised that the producers, out of her conversation, I mean, took that. Jim, I've got good it. news for you. She's starring in your play. She's an actress, and she just won you over. <laughs> I think she did. I pee I think in that's the what shower. That just to conserve water. Doesn't everyone? Uh, yeah, like, no. <laughs> well, uh, he's like, it's yeah, me, but no, not my friendly. mom. I want to call You're him Richie Magnuson. I mean, it's okay. a win-win, You're and it just, all the dirtiness just kind of washes away. Uh, Soraya, please open your bag. Soraya, this guy's got such a good high school coach. Yeah, stance. I will only stay in four-star hotels. Yes. Well, at least you know where the first night's going to end I have up. a question. <laughs> Aren't three star hotels pretty bad? Um, like, don't you get like pretty like they're motel- like doable? So aren't like some motel sixes like get three stars? I think that gets into two. Okay, all right. Three, I think you're looking at you know, like a you like go a, in and if something funky happens, you're not surprised. Like a hojo in I Vancouver. Think that's two still. Okay, I Vancouver. know what happened there. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Jerry, that just screams to me, high maintenance. And you would say? In my defense, I will say I do like my amenities. I have a certain standard for myself now, so. I don't think that's terrible. It's not really bad. Then Melissa. Yeah. <laughs> Takes care of her teeth. That's I sleep with a mouth guard. Well, at least she's not sleeping with you? a bodyguard. <laughs> exactly. I've never really encountered anybody who sleeps with a mouth guard, so I don't know what that means. Well, no, <laughs> ever question. since I was little, I used to grind my teeth at night. Mm. I got to protect my pearly whites, and I'm very secretive about it, and if it's time to make I out, mean, I slip them out. This really was easy. all just a ploy for her to get yeah. people to that stare at her teeth, because right. they're oh, impressive well, teeth. Yeah, Up next, I was supposed to sleep it's with a mouth guard freshman sophomore When Jonathan school, sees what's hidden in their, their medium-sized bags, Find out whose baggage falls off the truck when we come back. Ooh. That was a good one. That was whose a new line. Whose baggage falls off the truck? That's a good. That was for the East Coast uh, oh. Richie Max. A bong. I love how at, when they he, when Jerry throws it to the women, he just goes straight baggage. into high We're school the uh, football coach, so they can find new law. assistant now, coach, standing behind the coach the as the coach talks. The ladies' smallest bags. Now we've got Lachelle, who pees in the shower to conserve water. Soraya, who will only stay in four-star hotels. Mm. And Melissa, who sleeps with a mouth guard. Yeah. Jonathan, it's time for an even bigger piece of baggage now. This is what we call the deal breaker round. Now, here in front of me are the ladies' medium-sized bags. They're placed here randomly, so you won't know which bag belongs to reveal more baggage. Get it. I'm officially out on Bag this section. Bag number one. I mean, that's pretty fucking good I baggage. I still take vacations unless, with my Unless she says we did it in like elementary that? school and we're family friends. Bag number two. Or middle school. I mean, that's pretty big baggage. It's baggage. Oh. Man, that's aggressive. My man must wait on me hand and foot. Oh. Uh, what about the rest of the body? You know, he's yeah. going to do that. <laughs> An Italian boy. Yeah. You know? You know Bag number three. Ooh, dramatic. <laughs> okay. I Before or after? a fugitive. Dated a fugitive. Was like the orange jumpsuit while he was on the clue? run? <laughs> <laughs> Got yeah, it, right? Exactly. That's a rush. Which one of these is a deal breaker? Because oh, whoever to guess. that bag belongs to, I would guess, go. Man? We got um, fugitive. Left dated a fugi. That's what I was thinking too. Uh, Oklahoma. I love bank robberies. Uh, I don't know. Middle could be fugi too. Yeah, middle could be. I have right not dating a fugitive. What was the other baggages? Hand and foot disease and. That's the middle. And I date, I still go on vacations with my ex. That's, that could be the right. That could be, the vacations with the ex is 
I think they want the us to guess hand and foot for middle. I'm going to go right for hand and foot. I'm going to go date uh, with her ex. She seems like she keeps relations with all of her ex-boyfriends. She's just friendly with them. It's, she's just a friendly person. I'll go left. Look at the scowl on Oklahoma. Yeah, tough freeze. So she dated a fugitive. I'll go fugitive for her. Yeah. Okay, we got it. He's going home. Got it. Got it. Jerry, my deal breaker Stop is... explaining everything. Vacations with the X. Yeah. Because hand and foot can mean a lot. Oh, but he did have a big reaction. It's gotta be. The girl who dated a fugitive. Oh. I'd like to know more of the story. Yeah. I'm worried that uh, it's something she's still dealing with and that I would have to deal with. Don't need it. Okay. (laughs) Call the fucking cops. Don't need it. It is time to claim. Don't need it. Your baggage. <laughs> don't need you it. You know? Yeah. Don't need it's a pretty good line. Yeah, don't need it. I can <laughs> For non physical things, <laughs> just that is a good it. line. You know? Don't need it. Wait. No, are they, they gonna No way. Oh no! no! I said those could be flipped. Oh, She's a writer. Melissa, Melissa, Melissa. <laughs> what would you like to say? Scary. I didn't know. I didn't know. I dated the guy See, that's for what I was a couple about. months, and I thought it was really strange that he never had his ID anywhere we would go. Oh. But I thought he was my tall, dark, and handsome. I, I love Italian, ID. so. Oh. I'm sorry, Zach, Melissa. Why'd you it's wink at me when she said tall, and dark, go. and handsome Italian? No, what's your definition? But she didn't worry because all of our uh, contestants. The short Italian thick boy that knows yeah. no limits. Yeah, someone gave you that one time. Italian thick boy. Yeah, short, short Italian. Italian. Short thick Italian, thick short thick Italian thick, thick boy. Thick Italian. Short Italian thick boy that knows no limits. I'm pretty sure that's what well, it was. Well, someone wrote it about him once. Yeah, it was yeah. a description. Comma. Yeah. Uh, Italian American thick boy with no limits. So again, yeah. you keep and mixing you keep, in the you short. You got the word there. short. <laughs> you took that mentioned. out of your bio. If you search yeah. Twitter, twi- Twitter. <laughs> it's got six months of you perfect match. I caught myself online. before you. You can't see so it. Maybe Melissa will find Shut up! Hand and foot. <laughs> and we have Lachelle, who still takes vacations with her ex-boyfriend. <laughs> Why don't you guys join you me and her? Seat, and we'll find out the stories right? behind your baggage. Now. You are on a roller. Coaster. I didn't even know he was a fugitive. You know. I really love Italians, and I really know how to cook, and I am such a family-oriented girl. And you are lost. You know, she would have never cooked. What do you think is happening right now? Right. She can't actually cook. Welcome to the oh, hot seat, brought to you by Intellius Date Check, because no one should go on a date completely in the she's dark. Gonna walk she in. can so cook, she's gonna walk but what he eats... She's going to she... walk into Richie Magnicero's mom's house yeah. and say, I'm a good cook. Yeah. And... Oh, here's a bread You know loaf. what the mom would say? She hey. would say, why don't you make the butter pasta? Let's mop up the water with that. Why don't we start here with Lachelle? You tell me what your concerns are with the fact that she <laughs> takes vacations <laughs> with her ex-boyfriends. When you're in a relationship with someone okay, else, please. are you still going on vacations with your ex? That's a big concern. We were best friends first for a really long time, about a year, and we have an... Best friends for a year is not a long time to be best friends best with someone. Best friends for a year. They had a good stretch. That's so short. They had a hot to stretch. To be best friends with someone. They were best friends for like a year. They were new best friends. They were dating then. Well, then Amazing emotional connection. We left the physicality alone a long time ago. And yeah, when I meet someone and I'm in a new relationship, then, then obviously that's not going to happen anymore. Okay. Oh. You're dating this guy. Okay, Sounds and now like with dating. Soraya. She's got the guy in the first. first said she wants to stay in four star hotels. Yeah. Yeah. And now reveals that she likes to be waited on hand and foot. And by the way, so can she's we get gone you a cup of tea while you're saying that? Please, I would love that. Uh, I'm just a firm believer in chivalry. I mean, I yes. like my bags carried, my doors open, the bill picked up once in a while is nice. Um, if I do she's need won. something, I like my man to, to step up to the plate and take care of it. I that. think so. so. Okay. Um, in return, though, and you know, I do also wait on my boyfriend and you know and make sure that i cook for him oh, she likes being in a relationship she likes being in a relationship she likes being a team so, okay you know? oh, that's good. So, okay so now let me start with you lachelle <laughs> why should jonathan choose you and not soraya and soraya is is so pretty and oh, she presents herself really well but there's, there's a pattern with her and i just feel like 
I mean, do you want to have to deal with that? You didn't say anything. She didn't say anything. She didn't she finish really anything like that. In the way. There's a pattern. <laughs> she didn't say anything. Soraya, she was talking about Jonathan all of her past stuff. We knew what she was saying. Not Lachelle. She didn't. She just said, you know, do you want to deal with very that? The four-star yeah. hotels. And, and, um, <laughs> foot I don't mouth. know if but peeing in the shower is your thing and you want to go... Her baggage, you want to deal with that? Like, that's, you're right. supposed to add to the Running around with her and hugging trees and doing whatever that <laughs> she does. I don't know. If I live a high quality of life, I'm looking for Tree someone to, to share that with me. And, you know, my ex Never expectations are high, but that's because I also deliver the same for myself. So. But she's putting her oh. demands first, you know? I mean, she's all about oh. appearance. Yeah, she said well, you present yourself very well. I definitely well. have that's, a higher standard for myself she likes other about than you. peeing so in the shower. She looks I just like, can't get over Conserving okay. water led her to think she cares about the environment, led her to think calling her a tree hugger. Being in the shower, being caring about the environment is my oh, sin, okay. then I shall take it because I care about the environment. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. The crowd uh, goes here's, nuts. Here's, here's where I'm at. <laughs> I, I understand. The environment is my uh, sin, okay. then I shall take it because I care about the environment. Oh. Well, you see, that's a thing. That's a oh, thing right wait. now. Well, here's, here's, here's where I'm at. <laughs> I, I understand. Envir look, environment is a big deal. The environment's a big deal. Environment's but it a all big depends, deal. Jerry, on that big okay. bag. Okay. Um, well, he's like, prove this show long, Jerry. I don't want to hear you talk anymore. Here's Sarai's the thing. Big bag. Bring back the and other one. <laughs> Not John one single resident of New Rochelle cares about the environment. Did he sleep with his boss <laughs> to get a promotion? <laughs> Come on. Has he earned zero dollars? The recycling capital of that part. You can't say things like that. Broad generalization. in seven adult films. I filmed a... Uh, one of these is Jonathan's baggage. I mean, did you see Find his the truth motion he did when he said... Did he go like this? He's like, uh, uh. He was doing like the wedding crashers, like, uh, uh, uh. His mom wouldn't like that. I filmed a wedding in, a I filmed a wedding in New Rochelle once and we were taking pictures by the park across from New Rochelle High School and the bride, uh, they were walking across a bridge to go on the river and she was in a bad mood all day. Uh, you've been in a bad mood all day. And uh, that's Newsies. And she said to me, I said, uh, I held her hand so to cr help her cross the bridge. And and she said, yeah, you don't want me falling in there. The whole thing would turn red. That's pretty gross, I thought. I thought that was pretty gross of her. So sometimes when I hear newer show, I think of that woman telling me she was on a period. Or you hook up. I was holding her hand. She said it. Like, I don't know. Welcome back to Baggage. I'm here with our data, Jonathan, a bar manager who's looking for a tall glass of romance. <laughs> All right, now, these two ladies thought, are about right? to reveal their <laughs> biggest secrets hiding in these bags, and Jonathan will make his final decision. Now, will he choose Lachelle, who jet sets with her ex, but is the queen of cuisine? <laughs> or will he choose Soraya, oh. the four-star diva looking for a five-star adventure? Soraya? Soraya. How are we spelling Ladies, that? Is it a P.S. at the start? It is time to reveal we saw your the biggest piece of baggage. S-A-R-I-A? H? Like Mariah? What the hell's the second part? Probably never She's pitching a perfect game. It's a lot to understand and take in, <laughs> um, but never, probably never yeah, will. Man. Don't understand that. Yeah, I saw it. Okay. Don't understand that. So it started out as, mm. a, as a religious thing. You know, I spoke about abstinence at national conferences and okay. things like that. And, you know, it just, it just hasn't happened. I mean, to be, to be a little crass. It kind of freaks me out. Okay. <laughs> I know this is difficult for a guy to figure out, but I'm She just won. She just mind fucked Reggie Magnafucker. No. Because he now wants to be her first. Okay. The perfect game. Okay. What was he doing? Now, I just tried to explain it to you and you ignored it. Let's go to Soraya. He's Soraya been so happy ever since that's okay. happened. Okay. Uh, now, he was before you Jerry become judgmental question. here, let's go to Soraya. Soraya, it is time for you to right, reveal it's gonna be like your I baggage. Cut off my ex's dick. I fuck every. Uh, I, I like this. 
<laughs> I poured bleach Excellent. all over my ex's clothes. That would clothes. make sense, man. Okay. No, he was saying okay. That's at a different <laughs> level. <laughs> yes. Different level, but why? Um, you know, it's, I really liked the guy, and He's he, the show. he cheated yeah. on me. He's with another woman, so I basically <laughs> threw his clothes in the washing machine and poured bleach on him. You know, I was mad. I mean, that's just doing right. a bad load of laundry. Ladies, it's time for the final plea. <laughs> it's not, wait, that's Michelle. not what you're supposed to do. I feel like I'm a real person, and I'm the <laughs> But it, I'm it just seems you, like Perfect she's all game. about what you can give her. And she'll punish you for things if you can't. That's not true. <laughs> I don't think I approach life that way. It doesn't sound like quality. That's to not me, true. I mean, I guess everyone's definition <laughs> is different. Back, you know. So obviously she's lacking in that department in some categories. So uh, <laughs> she's a 13-year-old. Well, I mean, girl. if we're gonna be crass and superficial about it, then go ahead. But I think that. There's a lot to me. Well, she really just likes because the word crass. I completely respect that, but it's just a lack of intimacy within a relationship, especially if you like someone. And as you Is were saying, is the only that... time you feel intimacy when you're in bed with someone, though? No, not at all. That's not what I'm saying. Not a good what I'm straw saying man is argument, that 13 year old. I'm professor. simply stating that there is a connection which you obviously haven't experienced before. So. I mean, no. She played that well. This is the both of okay. them. Okay. They, Both this is the most they've well let them articulated. Now, I think this is a step for bad. It is time, finally, for you to choose. Uh, Will it be Lachelle, who pees in the shower to conserve water, still takes vacations with her ex-boyfriend, and who has never had sex and probably never will? Or will it be Soraya? who will only stay in a four-star hotel, whose man must wait on her hand Why'd and foot, like that? and guy, poured bleach. Her, her ex-boyfriend, who she's still dating, but she's never had sex with. So they, like, kicked, kissed once, but they travel together. I mean, that guy, you saw that guy, you'd be like, ah. Oh, yeah, it would be he, instant. They did abstinence. He's in the crowd. They did ab- <laughs> he's in the crowd. He's yeah. in the crowd. He drove over her ex's clothes. And he cheered for the abstinence. Oh. Jonathan. <laughs> Said one of these ladies Come on. packing. Very big decision. Maybe. Add that up. Very confusing decision. <laughs> What's that? Both the ladies, very pretty, gorgeous ladies. Okay. I'm sorry, but. Soraya, you have too much baggage. Oh. Welcome to the show, well. people. Jake have Story fun with that. You two enjoy. Oh my and goodness, that's embarrassing. I hope you never get late again. <laughs> that's like a guy who needs to pack up and go. Bye. Fuck, man. But congratulations. That's, that's pretty revealing for Richie, though. You want to go date the girl who's never that? had sex and hangs out there. Like, literally, those are things a uh, 14 year old girl But has. we still that's, have one more bed to open, and that, of course, is yeah. Jonathan. Did he sleep with his boss to get a promotion? I think he's. I think that, and he's probably like starting his own business. Like, or did he appear in? He bought out part of the bar. Yeah. So for three years, he's not paying he himself. Get any of it? And it's her decision. What's the secret in Jonathan's uh, maybe he big slept red with a boss bag. for a promotion. Did he sleep with his boss to get a yeah, promotion? Yeah, I mean, she definitely had. Yeah. He was yeah. like a Has lifeguard. He zero dollars for the past and three he was like years. And Not in the trash. Or did he appear old. in seven oh, adult films? Oh no, I think films. it was. Uh, <laughs> Michelle, Virginia, of those like three possibilities, a 35-year-old which boss? is the biggest so obstacle? What's the like toughest he's, he's baggage to overcome for you? Well. Jerry, since I have had what? no sex. Obstacle. What's the. Well, Jerry, <laughs> since. Toughest I have baggage had to no overcome sex. for you. Well, Jerry, since I have had no sex and. We should have that as a drop whenever Trev talks <laughs> on Talk Amazement. I have had no sex. <laughs> we, when, when he starts a Lord of the Rings. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Someone who has been in porn has maybe had more than that. Um, I think that would have to be my You're deal endeared breaker. to her. I, That'd be very I tough to overcome. To it would. Jonathan, will you please reveal your baggage? 
Slept with my boss. Also, to sex. Get a also, a sex haver. Yes, it was in the past. Oh yeah. When I was more of a wild person, and uh, basically it was someone I, I worked with. She was my superior. Your boss. And yep, uh, we basically, know. yeah, I did. You but you know what? I wound up leaving the company to go somewhere else because I don't want to mix business and pleasure. So. That's what you did. Man. So didn't you've heard his explanation. Yeah, after you've you seen it. his baggage, and now the question is. In spite of the fact that he slept with his boss to get a promotion, what a lot more of an a of a are you willing information to accept? There's a little bit of a fling. His baggage. John, I I know it was in the past. You were so open with me with all of the things that I I threw a lot at you, and my lack of experience in some areas, and and you were very open-minded, and and I. I admire that. That's that's amazing. On the other hand, the options. I don't know how I can condone ah. using someone. She does abstinence classes across doing. the country. I think your baggage is too much yeah. for me. She, you've had sex. Okay. He's so Michelle, I'm sorry. pissed I right now. I'm just a little too wild for you. No hard feelings. No hard feelings. Sweetheart. Sweetheart. Terrible handshake. It. She Take dipped care. his finger. Oh man, I'm out on her. I think she was very oh, sincere. It, it didn't work out. And uh, but like I think she, she was not an actress. Really. Got some strong I think that's who she and was. You stick with it. Which and I like. It wasn't an act. That is I think. But I, I, I didn't do so. it. You're a good person. All right. Well, yeah, remember, Jerry's being all nice. comes in all shapes and sizes. Sometimes it fits. You're sometimes it doesn't. We'll see you next time. Uh, I guess Michelle can handle my baggage. It's understandable. You know, she's a virgin. I'm not. I have a lot to take in. Um, I'm sure there's a lot of other girls out there that I won't have to worry about that whole situation with. Uh, but uh, we'll see. I mean, what was wrong with the other girls? Mom would have loved her. So what? She wants you to treat her like a princess. 99. Do that anyway. 99 Jerry's. 82. Out of 200. 80, 82. Times one and a half. 82.7 82. out of 112.